Hey guys, welcome or welcome back. Paula here with Paula's Imperfect Plans. Today we are doing some, I guess, bonus savings, savings challenges. Um, I got some money for Christmas that I am putting in challenges and sinking funds, as well as rollover from our drinks category and what else? Oh, just our rollover like at the end of our paycheck budget. There was just some money left over that didn't get spent. So what we have to work with today is 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, five, $95. So we're actually going to start at the back today, I think. And we're going to start with our Mother's Day and Father's Day challenges. Um, so those are fun. My Father's Day challenge here is new from Sisters on a Budget. So I got to look. I'm really... Okay, Paula, that's just not working out super well. Um, I really like these to be the same. So I like what I put in these to be the same. So I'm going to do 10 in each of these today. So I'm going to do 10 here. From Custom C Design Shop. And then I'm going to hop over here to our dad's thing and we are going to do $10 for Father's Day as well. Honestly, that probably would have been better if it were a different color, but that's okay. So we're going to put 10 in Father's Day and 10 in Mother's Day. So that leaves us with 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 115, 120, 125, 126, 27, 28, 29, and 30. So 130 in Mother's Day and Father's Day should have the same provided that my math is all working out correctly 20 40 60 70 80 90 1 10 20 25 and 30 130 so that is correct all right um now let's go I guess we'll start in our Harry Potter ones that we have left of that. So these are from um, Champagne's Corner. So I'm going to color um, I think I'm going to color two of these. That'll leave us with ten dollars put in today. So five. Hedgewick has all fives. And ten. So in this one, we have 20, 40, 50, 65. Our Quidditch one, we are going to put 20 in. That's also going to be two circles, 10 and 20. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 10, 15, and 20. 1, 20. Um, we're going to put 15 in here. That will also be two circles. So put 20 in and take five back. Um, I'm actually going to take five ones back instead of the five. Whoops. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90. In there. All right, in this one, and this is our houses here that we're using as a dice roll. So $6 we're going to put in there today. Actually, yeah, okay, $6. So that leaves us with 
10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, and 31 that we have in this guy today. We have a couple that I'm just... Um, not starting quite yet. I'm going to start them as it gets closer to January. So maybe I will, I think I'm going to finish this cow today since I have the funds. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. So I'll put 20 in and take two back and finish this challenge. I'm going to speed this up. So in our general term budgets, Bessie here, we have 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. And actually that was supposed to go to my hair appointment, which won't be for quite some time yet. So I'm actually going to come right in here and instead of putting the challenge back and making a whole extra thing, um, I am going to put that money right into my hair envelope so it is there where it needs to be and I'll take care of that. Um, that guy will come out for right now. All right, and then we have two, six. So I'm going to roll here, six, okay, for our emergency fund. And that will be a six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't think I could have planned that any more perfectly, but what we have in this now is 20, 25, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 36. This is a sushi roll challenge. Lisa Great from me um, with Happy Mailbox Co. And that's going towards my emergency fund. So that is what we have in here for our rollover and end of the whatever savings challenges. So thank you guys all for joining me today and watching. Um, I hope to see you next time. Bye. Bye.